I mean, uh, for me, one of the major, I think, um, learning from this trip is really um, kind of understanding the governance structure of uh, water resource management in Nebraska, specifically focusing on groundwater. I mean, we got to meet with the Natural Dis Dis uh, Resources District, which is really um, a very decentralized structure of governance. Uh, there are 23 NRDs in uh, Nebraska, um, which works at the local level. Uh, they have boards um, um, comprised of farmers, um, local people, and they basically manage and monitor groundwater resources. I think that is a, quite an eye-opening uh, experience for me. And Kazu, what's something that you've learned? Yes, uh, so I found that the, so the uh, stakeholders involving the uh, groundwater management have the common so, values. I think uh, that is uh, so the, uh, to protect the future. And we can say uh, that is uh, so sustainability. And so that, for example, the so Department of the, uh, Natural Resources and so the uh, Natural Resources District uh, having the uh, good coordination. So, for example, or the, in the uh, developing the uh, integrated <laughs> management plan. And so they are, these are uh, supported by some key issues. So the uh, ownership of uh, natural resources districts and trust between these parties and education, so uh, the incentives and so regulation. They are really so coordinated well. I think so these things are really uh, considered so when I communicate with the client. And one of the things I would also like to add uh, is in Nebraska, I feel that I've realized that you know, agriculture is really considered like a business. I mean, you know, you see, uh, of course, the, the farm sizes are big, but agriculture is really uh, an individual business. And I think um, the government having supported that with the right policies and regulations is something very, very interesting for me. Yeah, I really appreciate this opportunity. So we, will, we are now becoming really professional in this field.